Back to the channel, my people. Happy to have you here. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day. Hope you saw yesterday's video, dude. We had an amazing score at just one store. Wallfire now, we're up in a different area right now. Very excited to see something different, I hope. But yeah, I'm gonna check a couple stores that we haven't been to in quite some time. It's always fun to see new sites. Newer boulevards have been dropping. We didn't get to see many of them as of yet. I'm in the wrong area. All right, so far this store has been not that great, dude. There is some old premiums over there, dude. They do have this little display set up and I don't see anything good in here gent haulers here bazooka joe wow dude the tab haulers still here foos and sun speed shop these old auto drivers like the pez truck dude that is unreal bro those are old what's the date say yeah 23 release 10 so early 23 late 22 there is the model kits that we saw in yesterday's video there's a fox body we also have camaro ssrs there is some type of new 55 Bel Air, the Schwinn van. There's the Dodge Adventurer. I guess that's a newer one as well. And maybe somebody got lucky because there's only one of those. Ancient, ancient haulers, dude. They still have the boat here. Wow. I thought the boat was pretty cool just because it's kind of unique. There's one Yanko whatever. Even the Advans are gone. They don't seem to have the new Fast and Furious stuff. Still old car culture stuff like... Wow, dude, I'm sure some of you would be happy to see some of this stuff based on the comments I read, but it is peg warmer season here. Oh, check it out. Even the Walfart is getting these little pullback speeder cars. Ooh, there's the Evo still. Pretty cool. So it looks like wave one here at the, whoa, easy now at the Walfart. Dude, uh, some of you noticed in yesterday's video that maybe the floor band dropped a case off the top of that stack as I was trying to like make the clip holding all three cases at once. How stupid, but yeah. Yeah, it was super funny. I left it in the video. It happens, dude. I mean, I don't drop cases. I drop cars. You know, sometimes they just like fall right off the peg. So this is pretty cool. The Porsche 911 is still here. We normally just see the blue in the black cars. So I'm going to put these up with these so that in case somebody is like, oh, I really want the Porsche, they can have it. Looks like the hot wagons may have dropped again. Honestly, I'm seeing a few here. Ooh, definitely in, oh, F case. Wow. So they even got the F case here, bro. Wow. That's crazy. Already up to the F case. Robin cases. Oops, I dropped a case. All right, we're at Donner Quarter Street Plus. Let's see, we got an EG right here. We got, oh, that was close, dude. When you see that card art, it's tricky, it's tricky, it's tricky. What a great song that was. It's tricky, it's tricky. Remember that song? It was good. Anyway, Donner Quarter Street Plus, dude. Oh, hey now, Godzilla R33. I'm just putting it there. I'm not getting in. I'm just separating. I want to see what's in here. Just want to see what's in here. Hello? Okay, that's cool. So, like a peg find, regular treasure hunt, and another R33. And we need to check the another EG. Wow, dude, it's just full of good stuff. I'm like totally out of order here, but I want to check that Mercedes, man. We know you can find the last case soup in the next case. So I'm trying to find a Fiat. I mean, not like we need another one, right? Oh, wait, what is going, wait, hello? Okay, so there's some stuff here. J imports me, ata. Right, I guess I'll just start at the top here. 73, another R33, another Mercedes. Crazy. Crazy, so many Godzillas. All right, another mainline Merc. We'll leave that right there. Let's see, nothing, nothing. Keep them out of the way. Wow, this store is jamming with Godzillas, dude. Jamming another EG. Did I say EF? I meant to say EG. If I said EF, I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry. All right, keep on looking. I don't see even one Fiat, dude. Another Merc. Nothing. Or Mercedes, excuse me. Yeah, I don't see any Fiats in here. I don't see no Fiats. And nothing there. Nothing there. And nothing there. Nothing there. Another one of these. So there's like, what, 400 cases that showed up? And so all the, f oh, there's a main right there. Okay. Okay, okay. Show me another one. Ooh, another Mercedes. Wow, so many Mercedes. I feel like this is a pretty fresh restock. Possibly two cases. I have to count up stuff, even though we saw, I think, five. Uh, we checked that Merc, right? Yeah, I think we did. I think we did. We're just gonna look at every single car. Love truck. Okay. Come on, give me a give me a good Fiat, dude. I know. I know. I'd love to break my Oh, there's a lot of Yeah, there's a lot of lot I bet I bet somebody got lucky for sure, dude. There's so many cases it looks like. There's already another EG right there. Wow, this is the place to come get your EGs and skylines, dude. We're just gonna do a count. Alright, we're just gonna do a count. Shelby, oh, another one. Oh gosh, that would have been so cool. That would have been so cool. All right, well, at least there's something in here. They probably got three. Oh my, show, come on, show me a third. Show me a third Fiat. I wanna know, I wanna know. I wanna know, there's so many cars here, man. These dollar and a cool, oh, another Mercedes. Nothing on that, you could tell by the wheel. Straight away. Straight away. All right, dudes. I guess that's it, so maybe we're missing one. Let's count these these other cars. Another Mercedes, right? Did we check that one? I think we did. I don't know. I think that's it. All right, let's do a count. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so probably three cases. Uh, there could be another Batmobile that I missed in there. I wasn't really, like, paying too much attention to those Batmobiles since the last case had it and we've overlooked them so many times my brain's probably trained to overlook them now so all good maybe somebody got lucky we also got lucky in yesterday's video right, I've been coming to the store for like probably a week straight looking for the new Fast and Furious even though we got some I did let somebody get some in a whatnot show they had to beg me they had to beg me peg holes are showing but guess what dude they they're, they're here they have them hello uh yep two stores right there two Skylines oh well two Sylvia's right there dude like what in the world World, bro fast and furious more fast and furious oh we dropped a big bell air there's the mustang there's that and there's the gold i told you guys in the whatnot show they they are gonna keep dropping dude these cars are gonna keep coming out I knew it. I knew there was more. I knew there was more out in the wild. Okay, there you go. So for some reason, they were all out of the boxes already, just hanging out somewhere, and the Florida man had to get them on the pegs. I knew there was more Fast and Furious cars. I mean, here we go, dude. Look at this. Two Sylvias, two Soars, two Soars, two Sylvias. We got four, we got four, and we're definitely gonna mix some of these in for the people, of course. I'm gonna put them where it's like, you know, hard to see. Like, oh, oh, I'm so surprised I got these cars. Wow, that's so great. One, two, yeah, let's do a Soar down in this one as well, and then we'll do the Sylvia up there, and then I'm gonna grab a few. And I think we saw this truck last time, the Speedco truck. This could be the Chase. I don't know, it looks kind of flat. It's so hard to tell when there's no sticker because two different plants or manufacturers make these cars and one of them doesn't do a very anodized chase piece. Ooh, moving parts, check it out. Blockade, the 1988 RX-7. That's pretty cool, dude. In red, convertible, looks great. Citroni, Lexus, a Ford Focus, a Mustang Boss. I wonder if this case had the Evo Chase, dude. One, two, three, four, five, Five, six, seven, and there's supposed to be eight, dude. I think someone got lucky. Shout out to you, bro. Too bad you missed the Fast and Furious. No, that's all good, dude. I'm sure he's happy with the Evo chase. Ooh, lots of 124s. Let's see, the pink Corvette, Lambo, that car. 
Lycan Hypersport. Wow. Ooh, a nice Plymouth Roadrunner. That's pretty cool. Check out the, where is it? Right here. Yeah. So there's a new R35 with Naruto uh, RX-7 blockade's going to want. He wants every Dorito car they make. Really love this Skyline. It's the same one from Brian's Fast and the Furious. Just has a bit of a different livery. I told you dudes, I knew, I knew those Fast and Furious cars are going to keep dropping. I knew there was a place that had them. This was that place. And whatever, dude, now they're out and people can buy their Hot Wheels, thanks to the Florida Man. And Tarjay, of course. How about the 308, dude? The graphics look okay, man. Once we get some clear coat over that thing, get the interior back in there, some wheels, it's gonna be cool. I definitely wanna throw it in a display box. As far as the R33, I don't know what to do. I guess we could just give it away. It is and start over, you know, it's part of the channel, it's part of the videos. Cool, I had some store credit, so it's only a dollar twelve for a couple premiums. All right, I stopped by a dollar and a quarter tree plus, and there is no Hondas, there is no Skylines, there is some Mercedes, but they're main lines. I did see, yeah, like right there. I did see, where is it? Where is it? Yeah, there's a main line Fiat Modificado. Oh, dude, we gotta get five, okay? That would break my record. I've only gotten four of any scooper. Oh, wait, there's another one right there. Okay, so these two cases were duds, dude. Gosh, I would love to find fifth Fiat, dude. That would break my record. Like I said, four is the most I ever found in the wild, dude. Pretty crazy, right? Pretty crazy. Couple of cars over here. All right, I don't, I don't see nothing, dude. These were gone through. I mean, I, I think it was only two cases. But dude, come on, we need a fifth. We need a fifth Fiat. All right, we're here checking out Walfart now, dude. I found this old box. It's new old stock inventory. The only cool thing here is the red Cayman GT4 metal base. What a beauty, dude. Bill Stein livery. I'm gonna leave it. We're gonna leave it for somebody else. I do see the hot wagons again. I really feel like they dropped another wave. And just so you know, guys, the 914 is not a chase. I've said this before. A lot of people think it is. They missed packed the cases, okay? They were out of order. So, oh, hey now, hey now. We got four, four of them scooper treasure hunts right there, dude. But yeah, dude, they're, they're a, a mistake. And what's gonna happen is, I feel like we're gonna see those 914.6 cars showing up at Marshalls, TJ Maxx, all of the discount stores. Cause they're gonna have so many extras left over. I promise we wouldn't film these cars again, so I'm not gonna mention their names. But wow, the GT4 is cool. I like the 911 too, both have the metal base. Right, and as far as the premiums go, same deal, dude. Lots of leftover number 86, the same for these. Somebody got some Advan vans. The MBK van was here, and I guess people are grabbing them because they're not here anymore. I really don't see anything else. The Porsche is cool, the Cayman. Uh, I'm gonna leave that car for somebody else because I already got a couple, so. Uh, let's head back to the compound. I want to put some clear coat on the Ferrari and see what happens. All right, cool. So from my RC hobby days, I do have one of these amazing grippers or I don't know. There's some kind of name for this tool, but you can leave it in the comments if you know what it is so other people can get it. So many cool little adjustment points. The 308 only has one peg to hold. I've seen in the past where some guys will put both of the posts in these clamps and that's how they do their painting. So I'm gonna replicate this method. So as you can see, I won't have to touch the car when it's wet. Get my extreme lacquer shaken up here and we're gonna take this thing outside and do a light coat you want to do very light coats when you do spray painting yes it's a rattle can all good we're gonna do very light coats even if you don't get full coverage on the first coat it's okay because you're gonna do multiple coats that will fill in the little gaps so don't overdo it don't overdo your paint light coats if you missed an area leave it let it dry and then hit it again all right, it's a little windy out here, but just light coats. Okay, if we if we miss it, it's okay. We're gonna come back and do it again. It already looks cloudy. 
I hope it doesn't dry like that. If it does, that'll be awful. Okay, nice and light. We can hit it again. Like I said, it actually does look shinier. All right, that's it. That's it for now.